Hey there viewers and welcome back to another Quick Tip Tuesday and today is actually Tuesday so Josh behind me here has this 2008 Hondu Pilot and it came in with a intermittent blower motor. Uh, reach down, give it a whack and away it goes. Uh, I'm going to show you if a customer comes in with that complaint how you can simply check it with the test light. Now I'm not talking just powers and grounds at the blower motor but how you can actually check to see if there's an open segment in the motor. So pretty simple <clears throat> and a lot of times you can do this in the car you know this works great on radiator fans blower motors and this is assuming it has you know full-time power coming into it and then you know it's ground side switch to turn it on uh, or you can just take them out and test them like this now you can see these dropouts with a scope using you know an amp clamp you know we've showed that on other videos with fuel pumps where you'll have you know good amperage draw on every segment and all of a sudden you got one and whoop, no amperage draw so the way we do this uh, test light wise uh, I took a power wire uh, kept it simple, red's power, black is ground. Ran power to the motor, comes back out, ground hooks to my test light, and then test light hooks to my jump pack. So, uh, you know, there's current flowing through the motor, just enough to light the test light. And then theoretically, if this motor is good, you know, uh, you know, power's going in, it's coming back out, you know, through the test light, and all the volts are being dropped across the test light. And then you spin it, and, you know, technically that light should stay on. Now, I don't know if the camera's picking that up, but you see that little blink it has? About every 360 degrees light just kind of flickers there well technically if we find that dead spot somewhere right in this area the motor goes open circuited the blower motor will not work at this point if we were to stick ground to it so let's just see if i can prove myself wrong they're going to scare me so right now i've got power and ground running to this motor right here when we give her a whack she got run see what i'm saying so if you want to know for sure, like I can say you can just simply check it with a test light right there. That's the open spot in the motor. Go past it. You can actually hear the brushes are kind of crunchy in this one a little. And I assume they're just losing contact on that one little segment. So just a quick tip for you. Might help you on intermittent problems, radiator fans, blower motors, such. All you need is a simple test light and you can tell 100% for sure. That's it folks, quick tip Tuesday. Hopefully it helps somebody, like I say, super helpful on radiator fans, blower motors, and such. Hope you found the tip useful. Go down, click subscribe so you don't miss any free tip Tuesdays or whatever you call them. Find us around. And just remember viewers, I can do it. You can do it. Thanks for watching.